Welcome back, everybody. This is Melford James Hutchins. I'm reporting live about my Manning Bowman that I have right here as you walk in my house. Here's the door, and it's on the wall here next to this old paint, and, and it kind of has like a down view in my living room, if you can like see. Um, real quickly, this is a fan that my stepdad got me. He works at the Fargo High Rise where they take people in, and uh, it's kind of interesting. It's the Marvin name. But when I get that all cleaned up, I'll do a video about it. I'm going to be doing a video on model number 51, Manning Bowman, McCraw Edison Company. McCraw Edison Company, Manning Bowman Division, Boonville, MO. I'm not very smart, people. It's three speeds. It's supposed to oscillate, but uh, the oscillate's broke, so I got it rigged up just right so that at least the head doesn't go flopping around, you know? And I also have the matching box fan to this. This one here I got given to me by my grandpa's friends. They're, they're an older couple, and when I stop by, they usually give me something. And that fan that's above my bed in the back bedroom, they gave me that, and this one here was the first one. I have a zero, an Eskimo that's similar to this. But here, I think the first speed is... Uh, one, which I believe is high. It run, runs pretty good. And in the summer, I like to have it tilted, like, so it blows down on the living room area. That's high. I'll go down the medium. be nice if it oscillated though. But it doesn't. And here's low. I like to mostly run it on low. It's got the nice solid anchored thing. And in most of my videos you're going to see just to save space since I live in a trailer house. <coughs> I like to put a lot of my desk fans on the wall. But this is my Manning Bowman 3 speed fan made by McCry Edison Company. I'll make a video about the matching box fan. Thank you.